Hey, what's going on guys? <clears throat> I'm going to go through the system on how to post a workout to Wattify. So really simple. Um, I post the programming uh, every Sunday in the workplace group under the weekly programming tab. So all you need to do if this is your responsibility is go here and load it into Wattify and I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So I'm going to demonstrate how to upload uh, the workout. We're going to go Monday, <clears throat> this Monday, 11, 13, 17. So we go into Wattify. We log into the back end of it. If you don't have access, please let me know. Click in here. All you got to do is you got to go to WAD calendar. Make sure that you select the program. The workouts are already in there. They should populate. So this was last week's workouts. Hit over, and now you have a fresh new week. So to add the workout, you just go to the date. So Monday, 11-13. Click Add. This will pop up a new tab. And you can begin to fill it in. So basic details, and this is what I like it to look like. As you write in the date, so this is Monday, 11-13-17, workout of the day, so W-A-D. Hit save. And then from here, what you do is you start adding in the details. So the details, I'm going to add in sections. So first section is the warm-up. I like to have coach's choice, so comment, coach's choice, unless you want to put in a specific warm-up for people, and we add the section. So, first part is a strength section, front squat to box, finding a two rep max. So add section, type our strength, that'll come up, the add component, front squat to box, right here. So this one says 12 inches box for depth, so this one's not the correct one. Probably delete that. Come over. One squat to high box. 13 to 15 inches, what we have. We're going to make sure that we're scoring this one set of two because we're finding a two rep max. And the rep scheme is establish a two rep max. And in the comments, we write in any other notes that we have in here. So use 13 to 15. 15 inch box. I'm going to copy and paste that in here. Very simple. So, any sort of notes that you want to put in, we'll put in the comment section. So, hit save. From here, we're going to add in the next section, which is the Metcon. Metcon is called times three. So, I'm going to copy all these options and all the stuff in here we have added in. Workout. It's called times three, so I'm going to add section, metcon. Under here, I'm going to add and create a new benchmark metcon. And I'm going to title it times three. Add in the details, copy paste. So I can make this look a little bit neater by adding some spaces in between the rest intervals, just so it looks good. So people understand it. So for this workout, it's AMRAP, three different AMRAPs. So we're going to go each round. We're going to score three rounds, and we're going to score that for reps. There is not an RX plus option, so we do not need to click this. Save. That's in there now. Now I'm looking at accessory strength. Copy this. We don't necessarily need to add a scoring component here, so all we're going to do is add section, accessory strength, comment, paste, save. Now it's all done. So we got the warm up with the note in there as coach's choice, strength section, front squat to high box, average two at max, metcon, the details, and the accessory strength all built in. So nice and easy, nice and simple. And then all we got to do is we're putting in the next workout. Go back here. Click add. 
and you do the same thing for the next day. Thank you.